Welcome to the OSA Quick Minute for November 7th, 2019. Today we're going to walk through the new feature of uploading rosters to the OSA website. This project has been requested since the membership wanted to mandate rosters via the site, and now the capability is here. This is how we're going to go and get started. First, go to My Account in the upper right. Your school's information should populate here momentarily. Now I go to View School Page. That's how we're going to begin. Just now select an activity. Boys basketball, I'll use. Go to roster, and then we're going to edit team. Now, underneath the roster tab, you now see upload CSV roster. This is going to be your portal to be able to upload the roster into the website. A lot of great helpful links here, which provide step-by-step uh, -step processes, as well as how to save a spreadsheet into a CSV if you're working off of an Excel. My, re my recommendation would be to use the sample file in the upper right, Download that, uh, upload the correct information to the sample roster that you may see. Let me bring it over. We have numbers, names, captain, position, et cetera, et cetera. I already uploaded one, so I'm going to go ahead and, or I already downloaded one, I should say. So I'm going to go ahead and choose the file that I downloaded and updated. Upload my sample roster, hit open, upload the file, and then boom, I get the green check mark here at the top. Hit finish and close. Now here we go. I have my home and away rosters. I have who's the captain, the name, position I can now drop down into for basketball, whatever that may be, grade, height, and weight. As always, you can delete kids or add a new player manually at any time. So hopefully this step is a fast and easy way to save someone a lot of time when uploading rosters into the system. If you have any questions, please feel free to contact the staff at any time. As always, these videos are archived on the OSA YouTube page. I hope you have a great day. And we'll talk to you soon.